video is about how to export your site settings. This is assuming that you've already been in class and you've gone through the site settings. Also, I'll show you how to import your site settings in case you're sitting at a different student workstation. All right, first off, make sure that you have your USB in the computer. I already have mine right here, and if I click in, here's my Art116 folder, my name folder, and in my name folder, I have my index page, which we've already set up in class. All right, once you've got that, okay, and you've got Dreamweaver launched, you want to go under Site, and you want to Manage Site. I'm going to go ahead and click that. So we've already set our site up earlier. If I just click it in and just look at that information, I asked you to give your site a name. In this case, I called it Art116. You also had the option of calling it your um, MyNova username or your first initial last name. Next, what we did was we used this folder icon to navigate to your named folder, which we've done. Again, I'll just go ahead and click it again. Browser window opens up. You want to find your USB. You want to find Art Art 116 in your name folder and you want to choose it. Again, that was something that we have already done in class. Next, what we did is we went back to the site setup dialog box and we clicked on server. Okay, so that's already been set up. If this is something that you need to edit going forward, you want to select that setting and you can either double click right here or you can click the pencil icon and you can modify something like your password. The college uh, requires all students to update their password. So you will have to uh, modify your password. And in this case, the site settings that we've already saved out are gonna be obsolete. So you're going to have to export your site settings again with the correct password. So why don't we go ahead and do that. I'm just going to go ahead and cancel out of this right now because I already have it and cancel again. All right, under the manage site dialog box that we got under site here, okay, you want to look down at the bottom of this window and look for the very last icon, which I'm circling right now with my cursor. I want to click this folder icon. It's going to launch this dialog box. You can just say OK to it. Okay, then it's going to ask you, the computer's going to ask you where you want to save these site settings. What I want to do is select my USB in the first column. I want to go to Art116, and this is the location that I want to save this file. Note that this file has the extension .ste, and I'm going to go ahead and save it and say done. Okay. Okay. Now, if I look in my USB at this point, kind of moving the Dreamweaver window down, if I click open my USB, go to Art116, that file is saved. Now, if you're in the classroom and you're not sitting in the same location, the computer isn't going to know what these site settings are if you're sitting in a different location again. So what you're going to need to do is import that file. To do that, make sure that Dreamweaver is open again and your USB is in the computer. You want to go under Site and you want to Manage Site again. This time you want to click on this Import Site button. Finder window will open up. You need to find your USB. Art116, and you want to open this file. I'm not going to do it again because my site settings are already set. So I'm just going to cancel. When you do that, your site settings will then be in the in Dreamweaver in the on the computer that you're sitting at. And I'm just going to say done.